Hey y'all, so today I am showing you how to do your makeup fantabulously. So first, obviously, you want to take your foundation and I'm taking my, what is this, L'Oreal True Match in Classic Ivory and just putting a boat, a boatload of, boatload of it on here. Like, look at the, whoa, Papa, there we go. Just lathering it up. Oh, yeah, look at that. Wow. You really just want to paint a whole nother face on because that's, that's what all girls want. They want a whole nother face. You really want the effect of a mask. Mm. Now that you look like this, we're going um, to go in with um, some concealer as if the foundation wasn't enough. And you're going to take a heavy, heavy, heavy duty concealer. Like, so, so crazy because you're going to get a whole, whole bunch. And for this, this is a lot. You're going to get a bunch and just slap that underneath the eyes. Oh, oh, it burns. My eyes are burning. What am I doing to my skin? Next is powder, because you don't want to look like a grease ball. So you're going to take um, some powder and just swirl. <coughs> Get it loaded. Oh, yeah, you definitely want this to happen to your powder. Then, if this happens, you will know, okay, I think that's enough. So, just... <laughs> what am I doing? Just pat that all over. It'll help the cake-fiedness of your foundation increase and make it look like you just stepped out of Cake Boss. Next, bronzer. And... And you really want to defy that, define that jawline. Real, real nice like. You want the Michael Jackson nose. So taking it and just contouring. You go on the sides. Gives the illusion of a thinner nose, but and you want it very dramatic, very dramatic blush. Take a heavy hand to it because you want people to know where your cheeks are. Oh, yes, the more the better. That is what I say because here in Texas. You go big or you go home. And we ain't going home. Because we can't stop. And we won't stop. Taking this purple right here on, on the finger because that's the best. And just really getting it on there. And applying that to the lid like this. And going all the way up all the way up you want people to see the purple for the other eye we're gonna go with this um blue right here because remember the eyes are sisters they aren't twins so you can have different eyeshadow colors um so just take that on the finger really load it up and put that right there and make sure you bring it all the way to the brow now we are taking a little brush and this very b vibrant blue loading that up we're gonna take it underneath the eyes and just paint that sucker Okay, the brush isn't working. That's not as efficient as your finger. Let's get to going. There we go. Take this orange right here. Because blue and orange complement each other. So you're going to take that under 
me the blue. Next, taking um, a little liquid eyeliner and just, you know, not really paying attention to where you're drawing the line. Just as long as it's on the eyelid, you should be good. Just apply it up. A giant wing. Oh, that was perfect. You want the wing. Okay, the higher the wing, the closer to God. So, remember, the eyes are sisters. So, we're going to do a tiny stub wing. So, this one's more like the long and lanky. This one's more like the short and stubby. So, just... Next, for mascara, you know, it doesn't really matter. Just take a big one and just... Make sure they really, they all clump because that, you know, it really helps define them. Next is eyebrows. Now, I already have very um, untamed big brows and I really want to define that. So I'm taking a cream, very dark cream, and we're going to give me, we're going to give me a Helga brow. So super... You know, very squared off brow. Perfect. Now we are taking this glitter um, kind of jumbo um, eye pencil and we're going to apply this to the face. We're, we're being rule breakers. We're not going to apply it to the eyes. No. We're applying it to the face. Apply it right here. You really want to define that and make sure that sparkle is very noticeable. And you are good. You, you want to look like a disco ball. Last is the lips. And so we're going to take a teal eyeliner and line the lips. And keep lining the lips for lipstick. On the outside, apply a, a pink. And then for the middle of your lips, take a very um, like fuchsia pink. Look at my forehead. It's kind of crusting up and peeling. And that's what you want to go for. So this is how everyone should do their makeup. Yes. Just kidding guys. This is not how you should do your makeup. I mean, if you want to, go ahead. I'm not going to judge, but you know. So, I hope you enjoyed this video and found it sort of funny, I don't know, kind of crazy. Yeah, thank you so much for watching, and don't forget to subscribe, check me out on Pinterest, and I will see you in my next video. See you later, taters. Bye! I feel like a cat. Or a drag, either or. It doesn't really matter. Ain't no sunshine when she's gone It's not one when 